Hi everyone, this is Mick Lang with the National Concrete Masonry Association here with your Tech Tip Tuesday. So one of the things we get a lot of questions about here at NCMA is the use of concrete masonry in storm shelters. Obviously storm shelters are very important to keep occupants safe in extreme events and it's something that concrete masonry is very well suited to do. Uh, a resource that we have uh, on our Tech Solutions Center site, two resources actually, is a concrete masonry storm shelter design guide and a separate commentary. Uh, the design guide is really for architects, engineers, and contractors to assist in design and construction of tornado shelters. And the companion uh, case study and commentary includes uh, a sample design, construction drawings, et cetera, et cetera, for an elementary school. Now the design guide is really a, a comprehensive document, talks about the, um, uh, the issues related to tornadoes. An important thing to keep in mind is in this, um, uh, in this map of the United States, in this area in red, um, as of the 2015 International Building Code, every educational occupancy uh, is required to have a storm shelter. And something else to keep in mind with these is that it doesn't necessarily have to be a completely dedicated area. Um, there are a couple, um, Examples within the design guide, like this one here, that shows a kindergarten classroom that is also a storm shelter. All they need to do is close these storm shutters if uh, if a tornado is nearby. So, really, a great resource for those uh, designers looking to do storm shelters, and obviously something that, from a concrete block producer perspective, you can put in the hands of the designers you work with. So, hopefully, this helps if you're dealing with a, a design of a storm shelter. Uh, if you have a, another question that we can address on a future Tech Tuesday, leave it in the comments. Have a great day.